Okay, so this is my latest amp addition to a helmet, and this was by far the easiest so far. So I'm sharing it to you um, because what I didn't do was any soldering, any line extensions, any anything. I wanted to use it as is and do as little work as possible, and uh, it worked out really well. So what I started out with was a Ruby's Supreme Vader. Um, I got this one when I bought the entire costume, and it's actually damaged and stuff. So it's, but it's not a, it's not a primary use for me. But I just wanted to find, kind of fiddle with uh, some things and go ahead and add a speaker to it and see how it worked out. Um, other than that, it still needs some fix up, but that's not the point of this video. Um, so you can see it down here. It started out as this. Uh, the screen just broke off. Um, uh, this is a K Mag. A personal amplifier it does have an led screen which actually does add a little bit of bulk as you can see here not a big deal um if you do happen to buy this one know that there are two screws back here there are no screws up here which meant i had to bust this thing off in order to get to the two screw holes and pull it open um yeah anyway it's pretty simple you can see the board here i'll zoom in on that now it's upside down right now because uh that's how i can access while wearing the um, volume knob. Music. So what I've done is I've put a, a TF card in there or a micro SD card. Um, I put some tracks on it. It's, you, you can hear it's got the Darth Vader breathing. Um, it's also got uh, Imperial March, uh, Cantina song and some other stuff. Anyway, th yeah, this is the entire board. So what, what it came with was I'll back out for a second. Let me turn this off to and not interrupt. What it came with was um, the board, the speaker, uh, the mic, which all I did was uh, use some um, metal cutters and I cut the headset off because it's just a metal band that goes over your head. I ran the mic down the side here in this little groove that's super handy you can see the battery peeking through here it's about this long and um it plugs into this board so all i did was kind of peel back this this padding here and i just i put that stuff under there um i also wrapped up the the leftover cabling for the mic and just tucked it also into this little groove so that turned out pretty handy um and uh yeah so you see a an antenna here so this one actually came with a radio as well um you know that wasn't a big deal to me but i figured for the novelty and since it fit i went ahead and included it so it actually does it does fit and it does work um whether you whether or not i'll use it is doesn't matter but um it's that's nice to have the option um maybe i'll listen to npr or something like that while i'm uh, be bopping around anyway um so here's here's how it works out This does, of course, have a USB input, a TF card input, an auxiliary input um, uh, here. Um, this is the mic where it's plugged in here. This is actually a um, an echo, but we know that uh, Vader doesn't have an echo. It has kind of a reverb, but the cool thing about this one and why I use this one specifically, the ones I tried out, was that when you turn it down low enough, it actually does kind of sound like a reverb. Some of them still just sound like a, a lower echo. This one does actually kind of have a reverb sound, so I get it without having to um, put the um, the zoom stomp, you know, $130 or $150 or whatever um, fancy reverb thing in here. Anyway, so it's just an all-in-one. So um, I've got the TF card in. It plays fine. I can swap between that and... And this, it programs very easy, the radio stations. If you push and hold, um, play pause, then it'll just um, go through and it'll program everything that it can catch. Um, so just put your antenna up and um, program it, wait till it's done. I don't know, it got like 20 or 30 stations, but uh, no big deal. But you can see it still has a display in here and this display is not super deep. So it doesn't, in the Supreme helmet, it doesn't touch me at all. I just want, I'm putting it on, but if I use the straps when I, um, yeah, it's, it's fine. It just sits down beneath my chin. It's not sitting against my neck or anything. So it's nice. Bluetooth 
mode. It does have a Bluetooth mode if you ran something from your phone or something like that. But since it's got the, the SD card, uh, the micro SD card, that's what I use. So, but it's nice to have that. Music. It says music, but it's pulling off the, um, the micro SD or TF card. Um, and I'll just uh, do a little example of what it sounds like here. So your voice, this mic is always, as long as it's plugged in down here, it's always active. So you can, you can always run your TF card or the radio or Bluetooth and still get an amp for your voice as well. And this works well, really well. Um, you do have to kind of keep the volume at a reasonable level. Um, once you put the mask on, otherwise it'll get some feedback because you know, these are very close together. Um, I, I did put some, uh, I used a little hot glue um, to glue the speaker in. Um, worked out really easy, uh, works out well. Hot glued this at like this point and right under here, worked out great. And also hot glued the, the uh, you know, I'll, I'll peel it back to give you a look underneath. I will. Let you see the man behind the curtain. Oh, I might have put this down prematurely when it was still hot glued. Um, so you can, you can see there, uh, it's pretty simple. You can kind of see the cabling there, but I just hot glued the base of this in place. Um, and I put some hot glue on the antenna solder point so it wouldn't break off. But yeah, other than that, I just cut this little square so I could sink this in a little better. And of course, uh, hot glue it. So easiest one yet. Um, I can show you it with it on. This this mask is kind of ugly in its current state, but I'll, I'll let you see it anyway. Um, so you can kind of get a an understanding of what it sounds like. And I can't see at all what this uh, phone looks like on the other side. But anyway, test, test, test. Okay, I'm going to turn it up. Test, 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 test. Okay, I'm getting a little feedback. Turn it down just a pinch, and you can kind of hear the slight reverb in addition to the, the breathing. I'll turn it down just a pinch. It's still getting a little feedback, and now, it's, now it seems like it's pretty good. Um... So the volume is pretty decent and uh, I'm happy with it. So that's that. Um, hope that helped you out. If it did, leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you like. Um, that's it. I'm out, man.